Hey everyone, Leo here, leader of the Zodiacs, and this is part two to our church investigation. If you haven't seen part one, please check out last week's video. If you're ready for part three, we'll make sure to check that out next week. So let's get started. All right, we're back here in the church again. We got Deanna and Nathan with us. We got Roger and myself, Jay, in the church. We're going to see what we can find out, see if we can't pick anything up. All right, guys, we're back in here. We just want to talk. Right now, we actually have the owner of the building now. He has a meter in his hand. If you want to talk, just touch it. You can touch him. Just let us know you're here. We just got questions. We just want to find things out. That was so just let us know if you're here around us. If it makes you angry that it's being bought or if it's changing or anything like that. It is 2018, it is no wrong pie in your lifespan. Or if it sparks anything knowing you've been hearing me in here over the last couple months about how I'm going to fix it up and I'm going to change this place drastically, but while keeping the history intact. That makes you happy or unhappy. Pop was a foot noise. Are you guys angry that we are in here right now? That we're not here during church hours, we are here without supervision? Once again, it's okay to communicate with us by touching us or touching one of the meters or even talking into the two devices that either Roger's holding or what I have laying down on the pegboard next to my meter. Just talk into it and tell us. Make a noise, knock something over, anything. Is that you touching the meter? I'm not sure if that was you, so if it was, you can go ahead and touch it again. I just saw a really cold breeze, and yeah. there's no breeze coming in here. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Oh, um, what are you being for? Is it? Which direction? Straight back. Let me see. It's shorter? And mid back. Oh, yeah, let me get out of your mouth. Okay, I can see it. I can see it. I want to. Oh. Is, it, is it stopped or. Is yeah. It? I'm going to point to where I think. Yeah, right here, like back here. Yep. Yep. You can see it like coming up. Where yeah. you're doing if that was you pulling James's hoodie, could you do it again? The meter just went to orange. 
Whoa, look at it. Oh my god, look at it. That was me. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think she might get thrown across the room. I got like a tear in my eye about that how, how chilly what just blew by me was when I first mentioned it. Like that was very, very weird. You feeling all right, James? Yeah. Just been a while since I've had that happen. Yeah. <laughs> so was that is it the pastor that pulled me or is it the man that's been murdering here? I mean, once again, it's okay to touch me or whatever just for a sign of communication. What's behind you? One that's pulling you to a direction. See, I see bookshelves. I didn't mean the old door, but that was an emergency exit. I wouldn't say that would be. Are you angry that we are in here? Once again, it's okay to pull on my hoodie. when it was going on? I will say, um, when we were up, we kept hearing the voices in the back. It did sound like woman chatter, you know, like in, in a church, you know, woman chattering in the back mm-hmm. a little bit. That's what it sounded like. I hope you got it on audio. Yes. Me too. Are you possibly the wife of the man that was supposed to be murdered in here? Talk to us. We're just here to communicate, to figure things out. I feel that. I feel cold. Yeah. It feels like a breeze. I feel like a breeze. I'm smart on my right side and on my left in front of me. But see, I didn't feel it this time. The last time it like, freaked me to freak out. It was so such a cold breeze. Put your hand like right here. You feel any difference now? A little? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Do you know? Do you know what tomorrow is? Does Easter Sunday mean anything to you? So I'm not, I feel like I might be clustering it because I'm right on top of you. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> I turned the light on so you didn't do that. <laughs> I was looking at the camera. But there you go, that way, because I feel like I'm right in the middle of her talking. So I'll go ahead and get me. You guys do what you gotta do. We just want to talk and communicate with you. That's all we want. And you, you, you are allowed to come back and pull my hoodie again just to give us a sign that you stay here with us. Do you not want us in here? James. Yeah, look at me. Okay, it's just shadow. You, the way your shadow was moving on your eye looked like it was dripping, and I didn't know if you were like crying or something without realizing it. It looked really weird. It was weird. 
crying or anything? No, he flashes witness. He's now that I'm orange. Could it be He's that? on his phone though, it could be that. But I'm not sure I don't no. see it anymore either. Yeah, that's right, that's true. So is that you right now? Heads up, I got a little bit of a headache on the right side. On the right side? Yeah, I'm going to just send or receive a message or anything. I just received one. Okay, that could be that though. Yeah. No issue, we're just trying to figure out what it is, what it was. But yeah, I don't want to interrupt anything with my being here. I just, my girlfriend's wondering what I'm at. She's like all jealous that I told her about the breeze. And she's like, why didn't I go with you? Yeah. Oh, well, that's, whoa. whoa. <laughs> no, but that's, uh, no, it's totally fine. Like, you can do whatever you need to. Just, I didn't, I just was trying to figure out what it was that made it go off. That's yeah, like, what, that, that, did that just go off? Yeah, yeah. said girlfriend. Oh. Whew, this stuff is just, are you a jealous girlfriend? That's not set on a timer or anything. Mm-hmm. Sort of. mm-hmm. The only electronic sense is just to pick up EMF or yeah, EMFs. After that, that's it. So, are you up, maybe upset at your husband? Was he cheating on you or something? This is a new battery, and it was freshly charged. I lost one bar already. No, I'm just, truthfully, I'm just like, I feel a lot of emotion right now, and I'm trying to hold back tears. Like, I mean, I'm 35 years old, but it's just there's something going on that's not normal. That, it, that a good way or a bad way? Uh, actually, in a good way. Good. Um, okay, good. That's, that's what I want to hear. <laughs> good. Yeah, yeah because you, uh, so you, you start to feel a lot of emotion and you want to cry, it's you decide to possession. Like I'm possessed. No, 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 but what you could be feeling is one of two things. One, you're you're happy with the fact that like, you're excited about everything that's going on, so it's over emotional. Right. Or you could be picking up a spirit that's in here that's happy to see you, knowing that what you're going to do to this area is going to make it better than what it is now. You know, you might be feeling that emotion from a spirit itself. Uh, so, so, uh, so you're excited for what changes he's bringing, but keeping the history. Is he like fearing your emotions? Okay. Dude, this is, what are you doing that's doing that? Nothing. This is the only one I know. What's going on for you too? Yeah, so, um... Oh my god. Oh, you guys have no idea. Like, like, so, you are excited about him. Oh my god. Answer, right? So you don't want him changing it at all? Why was it going off so much before? I mean, it was right here. Mm-hmm. What you, was it positive? When the, was it reacting to positive? Or? Yeah. 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 Yep. See? It just went red again on both ears. So you're very excited. You, you want a positive change because you know what time it is in the world. You know it's 2018 that this has been abandoned for multiple years and it's ran down. It's okay. You can talk to us. We're just trying to figure things out. We want to learn. Are you excited? So you are very excited, correct? Just let me know again by tapping one of the devices. So you want the history to stay here, right? So everybody knows that it's been here, that it's learned everything. It is possible with a spirit after they can only use so it's like a, a meter they can only use so much and then it takes time to refill back up so if you get like a lot of conversation all at once and then it just stops that's usually why they've kind of used up all what they can at the moment maybe it was excitement mm-hmm. and that's why we got the e- we got the EVPs there that way they go they chatter in a box make a sentence we pick it up the EVP we can't hear it mm-hmm. you good oh yeah I'm, I just I just, I'm, uh, Over I'm, I'm a talker, <laughs> and I know you guys don't know me, but I, and I'm not saying much right now, but 
I just don't even know where to begin with the stories. I just I have a, a love for this town that I've always had since I was a kid, but I was always broke. And then I got into a business with a guy that does real estate around here. He's been very good at it, and I ended up being really good at it. And I just it's so overwhelmingly awesome to be in a spot to be able to be buying old buildings and fixing them up. And I was just telling somebody the other day, I've just I've got such an affinity, an attraction with 1800s around this area, New Richmond, Bethel, Felicity, you know, like our area, especially Felicity. And just all I want for this town and these buildings is to be salvaged. And I just, I even told one of my friends, the other, or actually a client of mine the other day, that it's just like I've got some weird, inexplainable connection to the 1800s, almost like I was like alive then. And... I just don't know. My family's not from here, but I've felt that way since I was a kid. And so for this read, this thing being excited, like, for what you're saying, like, that it, it agrees with me. Like, we might be hitting on something, like, you know, I don't, know, be, you know, I don't know if you're understanding. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it could be a positive change, or it could, because they know my heart's in the right place. Yeah, and yeah, the last place back to the way it was. It was a, the history books I read said Felicity was second in economic importance in the county in the 1800s. Like, it was it was a great place, and then it fell with shit. Right. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, it could be having the power change, and it could give it that chance to finally move on. Mm -hmm. Move on to the outer right and see what that, it finally got what it needs. So. Like, I don't know you, but I don't give you a bro hug for that. Like, that was just beautiful. <laughs> that was just beautiful. Like, I was like, whoa, because that's just like, and I mean, people, not, like, I just feel like that in spirits in general, but just hearing that in, like, another form is just whoa to me, you know, like, whoa. Like, and, like, he said, it, it could be that, you know, there could be just. Is your case going off? No, no. You know what Yeah, my mom's flashing red. I, I felt the need to come in here, and as soon as I did, it started flashing red. Uh, yeah. I'm probably. But, like, I gotta see what I'm stepping yeah, on. Yeah. Oh. But like that that's just beautiful. And like I I hope honestly. Oh that's so for real. Hey. Oh no, no, no. Thanks, oh. brother. I hope you got lost for No, I love it. And like like it's just it's perfect. It's what, just, what, which flash I need to use for the flashlight size of the big one or the orange one? That's the one. Right there. Oh, okay. But my bad for the other screen. Yeah, yeah. Nathan's kind words, but as you may have seen, there was words that popped up during the conversations. That is what we believe the Spirit was saying to us during those situations. The first one being a response to James's questions, and the second one, it sounds like a woman mocking a cat noise when we say it's a cat. I'll play this back again for you just in case you didn't see it. Yeah, that's a dead animal. I actually had a uh, kid. I want to take a moment to say how much I honor and respect this man, especially for what he dreams to do. He's going to a town that's having a lot of hard times and trying to preserve it by putting life back into the history that's almost forgotten. He's doing something that people have turned away from many, many times, and I truly respect that. And I want to say thank you again to Nathan for letting us come into his old church and letting us investigate it, especially for how long it took to go over the investigation itself. He's been very patient with us, and I say thank you again for everything that you've done. And I hope that I stick around so that way I can help you any way I can because someone like you definitely deserves it. Thank you again.
Nathan Jeffries. All right, we're back in here again. It's me, it's Michael, we got new company, it's Bridget, Nathan's back in here, and Kelly's back in here. We're just here to talk again, see who's all back. You want to communicate? It's very simple. All you got to do is touch the device either next to Cody, the one in Nathan's hand, or the one in Michael's hand. You can feel free to touch us, pull our jackets, whatever, just to let us know. We're not here to harm you or nothing, we just want to talk. Can we get the lady back in here before that we were talking to? She was, she was very active. I mean, are you still in here with us? Okay. It came right back to him again. Did it? Yeah, he, he's got, he had three jokes. Okay. Two, three, three. Wait, do you like talking to Nathan? Around him, know that what he's going to do to the building to help it come back to life. Do you want him to leave the building alone? It's okay. You can talk to him. We're not. We're just here to communicate. That's all we want. Mine's going off. Yeah, I just got like three different blends. Mm. Strange. So, so you do you want to talk to us? What's strange is that we used to talk about restoring and stuff like that, and it like seemed like it liked it talking to Nathan, and then as soon as you said not like it, like not messing with it, it went to Michael. Just strange. Mm. So is there another spirit in there that does not want the church to be changed at all? Do you guys have mixed feelings about it, mixed emotions? They put it down. It's on the satellite. Do we have an EVP? Yeah, we have an EVP. Okay. Yeah. Actually, we've got two. Are we disturbing you from being in here? with us. Because there's other things you can take energy from. We've got two cameras over by the window you can take energy from. You can take them from the EVPs or even from our cell phones that we all have in our pocket. I don't know. Oh. Besides Lily, she don't have one. <laughs> You're, I had an overwhelming feeling that something's right behind me. Really? Yeah, I had the same thing too. Like, real, like a lot. Put your K2 out. It's even like real warm. Did something happen to you here? It's okay, you can tell us. There's no, nothing's gonna happen. Do you think it's from the back room or like standing right behind you? No, it's not. I don't feel it anymore. Since I'm turned around facing that way. Oh. I have just an overwhelming feeling to get in the middle of you guys because something's right behind me. Whoa. Are you the man that Michael has seen walk past the window a few times? Or is it the, the lady you was talking to before? My, uh, make sure you're not close to his K2. But if you're the man of this building wanting to talk to us, in front of me is Michael. He is holding a device. Please go to him. If you are the female that talked to us earlier, please go to Nathan. He's right here holding another one as well. Okay. My moved my move it towards that way. There it is. Mm -hmm. So you and Jim and Jim and I have been there to walk by all those windows? <sighs> Are you the one that makes your presence known to me trying to communicate with me? It's mm -hmm. 
Could something happen to you here? I'm getting like a real ice cold chill standing right in front of me. Are you trying to tell me something ever since I noticed your presence? Are you the man that was supposed to be murdered in this church? Did you kill the man that was in this church? Hmm. It's very constant. Either it's talking or not, or it's... Nope, it just stopped. Are you, are you the pastor of this church, or priest, or deacon of this church? That's a heavy no. Okay, I can now. Let me try and ask this. Go ahead, go ahead. Were you anywhere during military laws? That's a no. Yeah, I'm trying to see anything too as well. I don't, his EVP was pretty far away, but. Put yeah. your EVP up against it again. See, that's. I can add to it, but it's still not close enough to. Right, I mean, it's going to go on. Yeah. You see, it's still going, and he's like stuff over Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's like facing out towards like that door over there. It's too. yours. Is there, um, are you the spirit that's been going to his house? So it's a safe haven. Were you part of the carriage house that was here? No. Did you know all of the carriage house when you were here? Were you part of the building's location prior to where it is now? If it was somewhere else? Yeah. Whoa, oh, dude. That's awesome. Okay, so... That's a heavy yes. So were you part... Was this church in a different location at one point? Hmm. Was it another building prior before the church then? Maybe so. Whoa. Was you one of, one of the guys that helped move it? Are you mad that they moved it? Mm -hmm. And is that why you kind of are upset that they're about to make it renovation suit again? A little bit, not as bad as... Are you happy that they're actually going to bring back the history of it? Hmm. Was you the spirit that was pulling on my hoodie earlier when me and Roger and Cody was just in here? I'm getting activity over here too. All right. It wasn't just no. It wasn't the same here. Do you not want us in here right now? That one seemed to die down some, but so I have a question. Are you the man that grabbed my hand when I first walked up to the building a few days ago, a few weeks ago? Hmm. You two switch. Okay, five. Yeah, I've yeah, yeah. got to stand up. This feeling is just overwhelming me on the back. Uh, are we on the back? Oh, yeah. oh is this still coming up behind me? Not right now. Where are you guys are standing? I don't know if it's from that or not. It's definitely colder over here than it was over there. Do you guys mind if I um, say a couple things? Mm -hmm. yeah. Whoa, what was that? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> like the, the same. <clears throat> well, again, my name is Cody, also known as Leo, as we've spoken before. I'm coming to you again because we've had different conversations since we first talked. Uh, I've been sitting back in the quiet to see how everything goes. I do have a, this device is a little bit harder to give energy to, but when you do, it will glow, it will um, beep, 
or I just know for sure that you are trying to say yes or no questions. So please, put your energy into this one if you need to, um, just to get your point through. Um, but, my questions are, I want to say a number of spirits in this room, um, a number of people in this room, not including us right here. Yes. Yes. I'm going to get around here. Are you currently standing behind me? Whoa. I thought I saw something right there, but there's no eyes. Alright. I see. Alright. I want to ask, I want to say a number. Um, is there more than five spirits in this room, not including us in the middle? So, we got Roger, Nathan, Bridget, Mike, James, and Cody. Mine, don't count these guys. Count everybody else you see. I'm gonna, is there more than five other people in this room? Are there three more people in this room? Is it more than five? Is it less than five? Are there two people here? One people here? Person's here. I didn't mean to scare you off. I know my voice is echoing a lot here, but realistically, I just want to know what is going on. And I keep sorry, I keep seeing something in that doorway. Just point that out. Is there? We do know that there's two different there's other spirits here as well, and I do not mean any offense when I say spirits. Um, as we mentioned before, a lot of time has passed, and we can't see you. Um, if there's another, if you have a name, we'd love to know your name. Um, or a gender, at least. We know that there's a male and a female here that we've been talking to us. Is there anyone else here along them? Is there a child, perhaps? Or is there only adults in this room? speak to the man that's here. The man that's been walking around and what is and you said that you are still here. You're not as happy as renovations as a female is. Are you two together? Like in life were you married? Were you friends, family? meet each other once you were here and decided to stay here? Hmm. Are there too many people in the room for you to communicate with us? You gotta take this. There you go. Why? You Fucking my head and everything. Okay. Alright. Whoa. Need anything? No, I'm good. Oh, that was cool. He does get like, attached and tapped really frequently and whatnot. So it is possible that he doesn't happen. He does come out of houses scratched up to hell, and then he does come out like new houses. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Oh, what? Oh my God! Whoa, there was. That was crazy. Did you guys not hear that or see that? No. Uh, also, you hit on back time. Yeah, me too. What was it? The rat? Thirteen. My living car came up here. So, what do you hear? It just stuff was rustling around over there. No, give me a heart attack. I know that. <laughs> Whoa, Cody, back up, back up, back up. Okay, you're good. I saw a face, but it was, uh, it was just the way a bunch of that uh, insulation was plunged together. Yeah, it's obviously there's been critters that run some here too. I didn't notice how rugged that is. Did you see that? Yeah, so that's the first time I ever put it in the There's feathers over here, but. Maybe a couple spikes over here. Hi, Mike. What's up? When did I get this in my pocket? Like, I know James had this, but I didn't put it in <coughs> Why is there playing? Hold on, I don't want to sound crazy. I don't know when it was playing. Yeah, James just handed you the camera. I didn't see him hand you yeah, that. He didn't put this in my pocket. This was put up over the pocket. Were you just making that device and Cody's hand start talking? That was my plan. As you saw, a lot went down, and as you probably heard, our EVP shut off right before this. So when that thing came running at Nathan, we didn't pick it up on EVP, sadly, so we're not sure if there's any voices or certain sounds that we may have missed. Alright everyone, so that's the end of this part of the video. Again, sorry about this, but there's so much information and we want to make sure that you get to see it all. So please, again, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to see the next part, and also, if you haven't seen the first part, please check out our last video. And if you want to see a behind the scenes, check out our vlog before that. Thanks again for watching, guys, and I hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you in the next one. Have fun and be safe out there.
Failure ain't an option, so I be cautious I hope that you're watching Don't try to stop this, work until I'm nauseous Cause I will not quit, no because I want this Don't try to stop me Failure ain't an option, so I be cautious I hope that you're watching Don't try to stop this, work until I'm nauseous Cause I will not